Firefighters in yellow hard hats, fire gear, and hoses spray down a hillside burnt to a crisp, clearing out what's left of a fire that tore through here near Fairmont Avenue and Montezuma Road Thursday afternoon. We were actually here while they were firebombing right in the canyon, got caught in the spray. Determined that the house was still here, which was very reassuring. Charlie and Janine Ertle live on Lila Drive, where crews race to protect the homes butting up to the canyon. They got here and there were flames up here and that they were able to fight them back because they said in a matter of a short time, a house would have been gone. San Diego Fire says crews on the ground and in the air were able to put out the fire, which burned dozens of acres and damaged several homes. No one was hurt. While the cause is still being looked into, officials with the department tell me the fire started in or very close to a homeless encampment. We've seen the increase of, in homeless activity in this last year and a half. Ron Anderson lives in the Talmadge area where some have expressed concerns about encampments nearby. Anderson says he's seen some in a canyon adjacent to where the fire started and another one close to Fairmont and Montezuma. It's massive encampment. The stuff that we find there, I mean, it, fire was inevitable. You know, they got, they got, like they said, propane tanks, they got gas cans, they got whatever, you know. But others I spoke to haven't. We've not seen the encampments, but we've seen people, you know, <laughs> shopping carts parked mm -hmm. by the edge of the road as people do their shopping and leave the carts there, to take the stuff up. All in all, there's one thing many are saying on Friday. Thank you to the first responders. What can you say? Mm -hmm. Good for them. We are very, very lucky to have them. Ryan Hill, ABC 10 News.